Hey everyone, Adam Mishani, our singer, songwriter, and vocal coach. And today we're gonna to be focusing on a warm up that's gonna build in flexibility and range into your voice. Run, run, lost boy, they say to me. Exercise number one is gonna be focusing on diaphragmatic support. So here I want you to put one hand on your belly and I wanna make sure that you're using it as you're doing this exercise. So with a hand on your belly, this is very important to set right, right at the beginning, that we make sure that our breath in is proper. So I want you to breathe in and expand the belly without moving the chest. Once you're able to do this, do it in front of a mirror or in front of a video camera so you could see what you're actually doing. Now we're ready to move on to step number two. Step number two, we're gonna put this into an exercise. And I want you to make sure that your belly comes inwards as you make that Z sound or Z if you're American. So, so let's do this. Now it's important for this not to keep the jaw too tight. So try to separate the teeth as you do this. We want to make sure this sound is relaxed. Now, I want you to also incorporate some movement in here. So we want you to move around, even if you're in a chair. Just keep things loose. We don't want to get too rigid as we're doing any of these exercises. So we're going to incorporate, this is a little bit of yoga with our vocal exercise so that we're getting some belly breathing in there, but also getting some movement, movement of the head, movement of the body, getting the torso to move around. <laughs> And so there, my voice is clicking a little bit at the top. I'm not worried about that. I'm not going to fight it. I'm going to let that happen. My voice will warm up into that. This is part of building the flexibility into the voice. Making sure you're drawing the power from your belly. Feel free to close your eyes to really focus on the internal experience, being very mindful of what's going on inside your body, where you're feeling points of tension, because that is crucial to be able to loosen up the voice. And back down. I know it looks a little bit weird, but this really helps to loosen up all the wrong muscles. So we want to do that. Again, don't worry about those breaks or clicks because you might be having them as well. And also to keep your hips loose, so like, you know, moving around in your chair, or if you're standing, even better, keep everything loose.
Awesome job. Now we're going to do some yawning slides. So here, I want you to start at the top of your range, and we're going to slide down as slowly as possible and quietly as we go through. This is going to increase the flexibility in your voice. Open up nice and wide like you're yawning. And here you can also loosen up the neck, keep everything nice and loosey-goosey. Now here it's oftentimes usual for the tongue to start to do weird things. We want to try to encourage it to stay right behind the bottom teeth. And try to find your way down slowly to smoothen out that break in between. And just keep the air flowing nice and easy, nice and relaxed. And if it encourages a real yawn, all the better, because that actually loosens up a lot of the wrong musculature when it comes to singing. Very good. Next, we're going to do some humming slides. With this one in particular, I want you to imagine there's a hot potato on your tongue and we don't want it to touch the roof of the mouth. So instead of humming like this, with everything tight inside the mouth, we're going to open up. And with this one, we're going to put it on a slide. So we're going to go. And with this one, you might look like one of the Muppets, but that's fine. All of these exercises make you look a little bit bizarre. So <laughs> try to do it in your car or in a private room. And don't avoid any clicks or breaks. Try to move through them as opposed to trying to run away from them. Remember not to hold anything rigid, keep everything nice and loose. So it's wobbling around there for me. I just let that flexibility start to build. It's when you go to stretch, you're not going to be your stretchiest the first time you do it. It's going to come with time. Think of doing it really nice and, and fluid. And back down. Mmm. -hmm.
So I hope that was helpful. Let me know if you have any questions down in the comments down below. And this will help you if you do this on a daily basis. It will increase your range, increase your flexibility in your voice, and get it moving properly. If you found this helpful, but you want more of a roadmap, exactly what you should do day by day in your singing journey, then I highly recommend joining my singing community. In there, you get access to small bite-sized daily chunks that you can do, and it's gamified. What I mean by that is everyone in the community is competing against each other, and one of the first that completes the daily challenge will win a $100 Amazon gift card. So click the link down below to join now. And if you want to see more videos like this, click on this one. You're going to like it too.